Hi, and welcome to Horn Trader on YouTube. Today, uh, another one of my special guests is a Vox Stradivarius. It looks like it's had a little work. I'm not going to lie. It looks like it might have been overhauled or at least reshot with lacquer. Uh, you can see it's a vintage horn. Uh, serial number 68878. So I'm going to say it's right around uh, late 60s, early 70s. Looks like it's been shot with gold lacquer. The bell does not say corporation. It just says Elkhart. And I can't tell if the bell has been replaced or not. I can tell you that the two little... Uh, braces that go from the valve section to the, the uh, bell and also here to the lead pipe have been removed and evidence of that removal is apparent. I can tell you this one plays really good and um, valve section is extraordinarily fast. lively especially my little la freak on the side here holy smokes feels like the horn just wants to take off i think it's a little more uh livelier blow than a bach 37 still feels like it has the same resistance but um a little brighter and um, um it feels because of the braces are that are removed it seems to resonate quite well in your hand good on those low C sharps. <laughs> Feels good on the F sharps, high A. Uh, if we were to apply something a little softer on it. Let's try this. We're going to put our little um, uh, HT3 Jazz mouthpiece on that. Bring in the tuning slide ever so slightly. And let's see what we can muster out of this horn. Very fine playing horn. You can find this wonderful instrument in the vintage category and also in the B-flat trumpet category and also in the Bach trumpet category. A few other things I can tell you about it. It looks virtually, oh, here's a little ping. I was going to say virtually dead free, but it's got a little ping. Uh, maybe uh, signs of red rot kind of hard to tell because the the lead pipe has been torched a little. Sometimes the acid for the torch will make the the uh, uh, lead pipe get a little spotty on it. But uh, it's not bad if it is at all. And even if it was bad, uh, my good friend Charlie Milk with his wonderful uh, MTV 25 
uh, pipes could do a really nice number on it. So uh, if you want a nice, pretty soloist horn, a jazz horn, and you love Bach 37s, and you want incredibly fast valves, this is the horn for you. And if you want a Lafrique, go to the Lafrique section of horntrader.com. Thanks for listening. We'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.